what's going on guys welcome welcome to a different type of video so today um i have decided to show you guys how to be organization 13 in kingdom hearts 2 now we're going to be starting with one of the most annoying but one of the most fun fights which is uh actually axel and really for this fight um there's a multiple way there's multiple ways to handle it really um you can go with like one or two ways which i do it just fight him regularly, which is just put this piece of pumpkin and then whatever you want. Or you can go with the cheese way, which is Mysterious Abyss. Um, and then obviously, uh, check to see if I have it here. Um, and for a safe measure, I would definitely bring ethers with you. Um, I like to carry elixirs, but I wasn't fully stuck. But, but you definitely want to be. You don't need mega elixirs for this fight because it's a solo fight. But for the other the fights such as um, Lexius and Zexian, you definitely want mega elixirs. Right, so Axel's going to open the fight with a fire attack kind of... I don't know what to call it. I guess a fire battlefield, which covers the field in all fire. And there's two ways, two ways to dodge this. You can dodge roll it. Or you can, you know, reflect it. I'm going to reflect it. Come here. I'll make it all stop. Burn, baby. Get back. As you saw, he just did the get back move, um, which doesn't really get around your guard too much because of the lock on mechanic. Even if you're not locked on, Roxas will turn around very suddenly. Like that. And really, he has really just two moves. It's that move and then Sora. That one right there. So, really, it's not a hard fight. The only thing to keep in mind is the, the battlefield with his real death. Which can be a pain in the ass, especially if... You know, you don't really keep track of it. But the strat we're going to be doing here, I'm going to be showcasing, is both um, the Fenrir strat, I'm going to be showcasing the Blizzard into Limit strat, and then I'm just going to be showing if you just want to regularly kill them. But first, we'll do the Blizzard strat. This consists of literally using two Blizzards and then an immediate Reflect. Now, Axel's full, you won't forget this, you know, attack, that is really just, it's super easy to dodge. You basically just block, you stagger your block for like a second, and then you block again, and then dodge roll, as such. And it's really just the same thing every time. If you block into the flames, it won't really hurt you. Um, it's only if you go up against the wall while you're, you know, not blocking, um, then it will definitely hit you, the firewall around the arena. So after this, you can just go into liver form, and then send Tsukin and Ars Arcanum him down. I did forget to mention, you cannot kill Axel while his fire is on the ground, so you just want to do basically a finisher, either explosion in your regular form, or you can do any of the limits finishers from limit form, just a finisher. That gets him up in the air, and he will go into the flames, and you got to be ready to do a reaction command, um, two of them, and the second one here will actually clear the fire, and this is the only way that you can actually kill him. And that's Axel. 
I will quickly show the Fenrir strat for this and then show the um, regular way of killing them. So the Fenrir strat is basically, as you saw me, you might have seen it um, in my Terra video. But the finisher for Fenrir, um, if you have all combo pluses off, you definitely want that. So you want that, you want your negative combo equip that you get from leveling up, and then you want the negative combo from um, Fenrir. You also want to turn off Aerial Finish and Magnet first, because those will count as finishers and they'll mess this up. Now Fenrir's... Um, strat with Fenrir is that the finisher with it actually has a bit of knockback that keeps the opponent basically to the ground so their forced revenge value does not actually go off um so you can just keep wailing on him and then when you're ready to well get him to use a reaction command you can just go into limit form and use um any of the limits and that's it so i will show you how it's done here All right, and the last one I'm going to be showing you today is just if you just you just want to literally just fuck them up. Now, this can be done in a variety of ways. Um, cannot really... I've tried it a bunch of times and I ended up dying from it, trying to do um, horizontal combo with him. But it doesn't really work with me because of that freaking wall. Um, so it's a, it's a bit annoying. Um, not really bad, though. So, and now we're just gonna fuck up Axel. All right, thank you so much guys for watching. This has been episode one of Defeating Organization 13 and KH2. My eyes are a bit tired because it's 3.30 uh, a.m. I want to make this video for you guys, so that is Axel. Please make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. My next video is probably going to be the KH Journeys episode two. I'm not sure it'll be out, but it'll be out next week. So. 
Cage fans. I will see you later. Peace.